hey y'all okay so i'm back it is monday uh afternoon i um went in early today or i clocked in early today so i can get off early so i'll be able to go pick up my car so i have to drive to my mom's house pick her up then we're gonna drive to the car place and then i gotta drive back home so and see that's inconvenient too because my car has been in and out of the shop for the past three weeks i told the lady an hour away from you and she was like oh whatever is wrong with it whatever she think is wrong with it she was like just drive for two weeks if it's still giving you that problem then bring it back and we'll know exactly what it is ma'am i live an hour away from you i can't just you know just be dropping my car off and bringing it back and dropping it off like i, and I already know when i get it it's gonna be doing the same thing and i'm kind of frustrated i'm kind of tired but i paid this lady twelve hundred dollars i paid this place twelve hundred dollars to get my car fixed so yeah so <laughs> i'm a little frustrated um but i'm trying to decide whether i want to take g with me or not she always with me but i'm gonna take her um so i'm about to take her out really quickly um and then what time is it? i told my mom i'll leave home at 2 15 so i'm about to take her out so she can use the restroom and uh, we're about to hop in the car and we're gonna go get my mom and do all that kind of stuff that i just told y'all i see y'all later so I just got my car back up. Turn this off. So I just got my car back again. And when I started it up, it's still doing the same thing. But she's talking about driving for two weeks. And she put everything on the um on the thing. Um, but again, I'm still a little frustrated. But whatever. So me and my mom are headed to look at this car that I was looking at again. We just headed to look, you know, we just trying to see some real quick. Just trying to see some. I'm not gonna buy a car today. I don't think. I don't want to buy a car today, but um, we gonna see. So I will talk to y'all when we get to. My mama's so funny. She keeps saying, "Why you want to look at that car? You ain't gonna get no car right now." And I told her because it made me feel better. It uplifts. It brightens up my day. Y'all say hey to my mama. I got her out here looking at a car with me. And she is not mm. happy. But I should be want to spend time with my poo poo. My little poo poo. And then my other little poo poo. If you want to spend time, maybe you will be looking at no car. Maybe you're doing something else. <laughs> what we finna do, Mom? I gotta go home. My day hurt. What you do to me? To me and you. I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause love you give. You can't be the car dealership. I was in there a little bit longer than I expected. Specifically, I just asked him for the car things, but he creating a whole profile, getting my damn driver's license and all that stuff. I respect that your car sale, you gotta get it how you can. I ain't made it to sir. But, um, so it was asking a few kind of, you know, a few different questions. So initially, anybody that knows me, initially I wanted the BMW X6. Um, but the only thing about it is, I don't like the newer ones. I like the 2018. I don't like the, how the back is made on the newer ones. Okay, so I was thinking about getting, um, getting the newer one but then everybody's talking about how you know the quality of a bmw is not that good the value does not hold but the value of a lexus is like the second best part i was like okay i might as well you know look at this Lexus, and so that's what i was just looking at the only thing that i don't like about that car is it doesn't have a sunroof so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna see if i can find that specific car if i can find it with the sunroof if i can so it's fine to me <laughs> but if i can't yeah we vibrate but if I can't, you know, I really like that car. So we'll see. And it only had 30,000 miles on here. Good morning, beautiful people. So today is Tuesday morning. I decided to kind of switch up the setting a little bit. Because <laughs> I'm normally at the kitchen table talking to y'all. But um, I was in here doing my makeup. And I was having some thoughts. So I was like, let me get the grows so we can think through some things together. So... It is Tuesday morning. I have to go into the office today, so I am putting a little makeup on, honey. So, um, y'all know, so I was sitting here thinking, y'all know I, I I do content on, on my social media uh, platforms, TikTok. I was real heavy, uh, real heavy on Instagram, but it's like the market is getting over overly saturated and it's like to me this is just my personal opinion the market is getting oversaturated 
and it's like everyone is kind of doing the exact same thing like there's no originality it's originality a word like it's like no no one's being original like i don't know so i'm just i haven't recorded content on there in a while and my content my views are really low like initially when i started off i had decent views they weren't like the best but my views are really low too so it's just like the market is just it's just too much it's too much too much so i've been kind of stepping back from that and just uh, um just kind of reanalyzing some things just seeing what i can do different so i need to put on my um my um my um my calendar like i want to do i need to maybe do some content today and um i need to do some content oh i need to make an intro to my youtube videos i had one i used the wrong um concealer and you can tell so i need to do an intro and i, I recorded one but i recorded it the wrong way so that ain't gonna work out so i need to record another intro oh, i'm kind of on the fence like i don't think that i want to um sell my kitchen table anymore and one reason is because so many people have inboxed me about it like this one lady she was like oh like two ladies like you know they're supposed to be coming to pick it up so then i don't hear from them and then this one lady was like oh can you hold it to this time and i don't even be messaging all these people back because why y'all wasting my time so i don't know if that's like a sign like maybe i need to wait because i am trying to um, I don't know, maybe I just need to wait. <sighs> All right, so I'm ready. I got the clothes on and we're gonna go. So I know it's April, but it's cold outside. So I threw on this light sweater. Um, this is from New York and Company. My boobs getting a little big, I guess, because the little holes, you can see through those. These are um, my slacks. These are from H&M and my same little um, loafers or you know whatever these are with the little tassel on the top that y'all always see from ds7 so this is what we're looking like today real business casual um hair pulled back i'm about to take g out again oh, excuse me before i leave i don't have any lunch or anything oh i don't have any lunch or anything today so yeah this is what we're looking like um these are the uh frames that i got from uh, she in that I showed y'all on the last video and my contacts. Oh, I gotta take my vitamins. Um, so yeah, we gotta get a routine together when I get home, like a little workout routine. I have to start being more active. Um, so we gonna maybe do two laps around the neighborhood when I get home. I'm gonna start stretching and all that good stuff. I gotta start getting, like I said, active. I need to get my um planner. Put this in my work bag. So, oh, y'all, also, I bought another um, case, like a frame case for my glasses to hold them because I'm getting so many. So, I need more room, more storage. So, I bought another one of those. Hopefully, those will be in either tomorrow or Thursday. Gee, get out. Oh, I got a few packages coming in Thursday, too. So, y'all, yeah, I'm going to get in the car, get ready for work. I mean, get ready to go to work. I'll see y'all either on the road when I get to work or after work. I'll see y'all sometime. Y'all have an amazing um, Tuesday that I'll talk to y'all. Um, yeah. Okay. So, it is lunchtime, and I am headed to Kava, of course. Um, but, so, have you guys ever ran into, um, like, an older woman? And, you know... Okay, this is just my experience. I've experienced this older woman um, who's just negative. You know, a lot of times women of age, when they're not in certain positions in certain places, or you know, that they're they're kind of bitter and unhappy, and they try to um, I don't know what I'm trying to say, um, but situation so i was talking to this older woman one day and we were talking and she was like you know she feels like women that wears like designer things they just be trying to show off and they ain't really got nothing and all that kind of stuff now i'm not the type yes i have a few designer items but i'm not the type to show off and all that and so the next day when i saw her i came in and i had on a gucci belt i don't know what she was thinking you know when she saw me with that gucci belt on after we had just had that conversation it's like you can't say that all women that choose to wear designer things or show up she was, she was just like you know stuff like that don't don't excite me i mean don't excite me either but you like what you like just you know if you like 
you know shopping at dsw you know and that doesn't excite you but you just like shopping at dsw you know if i just like to you know splurge on myself or do something or buy something that's you know a little bit more expensive that i like then that's just something that i like i don't like stuff like that and then a lot it's just like a lot of things that people say like just because you know your life did not work out as you planned and you see other young women out here living your life don't be salty be like you know i see you beautiful you out here living your life be happy you know you're supposed to i feel like women of that age are supposed to uplift young women and you know in life, one day she was talking about the car that she drives and she was like these women be out here driving these mercedes and these bmws and they ain't that and they ain't this and they ain't that ma'am and i'm sitting here like i wonder what the hell she gonna say when she see me pull up in my my bmw x6 and you see what i'm saying i wonder what what, what she gonna have to say then but it's just like i never as an um i guess that shit i'm an older woman now but as a woman like if one of my friends or someone younger than me if they come to me and they're telling me something that they enjoy or something that they like i'm gonna tell them like yes get that if you can afford it do not put yourself in a financial bind trying to get this knowing that you can't afford it if you can afford it yes get it i ain't gonna be out here tell you to get something you know your eggs can't afford it now because i don't want you asking me for no me because i ain't got it okay but yes if you can afford it get it you only live you, you ain't got number one life to live that's it we ain't got number one we ain't get another one if you want that mercedes and you can afford it so <laughs> i'm coming to you guys live from my um kitchen floor remember when we spoke earlier i was like oh i'm not gonna sell my kitchen table i'm just gonna keep the one i have i just sold it <laughs> So I ain't got no kitchen table now. So I got family got up on table, honey. Let's see how long this gonna take. All right, y'all. So we got some work to do. We got some math. We got some homework to do. All right. So y'all know I'm talking to y'all this morning. Sometimes I don't think I'm gonna sell my table. These folks came got it. I got the two hundred dollars, and I ain't paying no more about the table since, honey. But now on to bigger and better things. So what we have to do now is see if we can get that lady to lower her price down. Okay, originally she had her table listed for $75. I offered her 50. She said, give me 60 and it's sold. I'm not paying $60 for it. I'm gonna give it a couple of days, which is, has been a couple of days. And I'm gonna go back and say, hey, so you still don't wanna give me, you still don't wanna accept 50? I got a budget. I'm about to do this whole table for $200. So we're gonna have to see how close we can get to $200 for this table. And I think that we can, I think we can do it. What y'all think? Good morning. Today is Wednesday, November the 26th. Um, sitting at my desk, going through my emails and then take a little break. And then I'm gonna try, I need to go to the post office on my lunch break. So those uh, thick brown shoes with the bow on them, I decided not to keep those. They're a little bit too high for me, a little bit too bulky for me. So I'm returning those to Fashion Nova. And there's also this top that I bought from Shein um, that's a little bit too big. It's actually a small and it fits like a medium. So I'm returning that one and I'm gonna get an extra small. So um, I gave G a bath last week. And when I tell y'all for the life of me, I took off her um, her collar. I don't know what I did with it. And it has her, and that's the collar, like her main collar that has like her tag and stuff on it. Yeah, I don't know what I did with my baby collar. So, is this what I bought? You know how you buy something, then you look at the box? So I supposedly bought her a new collar, but let me see if this don't. Okay, okay. Okay, that is kind of cute. G, come here. So this is the collar that I bought her. G's mom is plain and simple. I just listened at my store. So I didn't bring food with me to work today because we were supposed to be having, or I thought that we were having uh, um, like uh, a departmental, is that a word, departmental? Uh, like a meeting, our department was having a meeting. So normally, you know, everybody comes in that works from home, you know, we have a big old meeting like that. So I thought that that was what was going on today, so I ain't bring no food. Lil o'clock, <laughs> I think the meeting over started like 10.30, Lil. 10.30 pass by. I'm never physically in the meeting because I don't really deal with the department that I'm assigned under. But my boss always give me some food because I be wanting to eat sometimes. So, a girl, 10.30 pays by. 
let them 30 pays back. I'm like, no, I'm with my own, with my croissant. <laughs> with my own, my chicken salad. I ain't got no chicken salad. So I ain't bring no lunch to work today because I'm thinking that I'm going to give me something to eat. Baby, hold up. Back, Aaron was calling me. Aaron, to hang up on your ass in a minute. <laughs> but anyway, so, yeah. So I ain't bring no lunch. Like I'm finna give me something to eat. Give me a my mouth fixed on my chicken salad with my croissant. I just went back and looked at the email. The me was yesterday. The, the, the on the twenty six. Today the twenty still. If I ain't be got dog on my stomach, sitting here biting back. What the fuck doing? My my stomach is eating me from the inside out, and I ain't. I, and I'm just sitting here letting it do them. Hampton boys today drained me, baby. I'm normally the first thing smoking out the building. I still see cars out there when I leave. I ain't seen that now. Everybody gone. I'm just not leaving work, but they milked the cow today, and I'm the cow. They got their money worth out of me today, and I still feel like I didn't do something right. So, what was it, police? Police couldn't wait up. Okay, so. All I'm saying is, I'm tired. What are you doing today? So I got some packages. I saw the, um, my neighbor dog, Lucy and G like to play together all the time. So I guess Lucy got a Lucy. She came to my front door. And so of course I, I got the uh the door, I got cameras. And so girl, I saw the little dog running from my dog. I thought somebody had like, been in my house and let my baby. I'm gonna have a heart attack. Y'all should have saw me finna leave work on two wheels. But that's beside. Let me call this man and see when he gonna come do my damn keypad. Hold on. So I bought this. I don't know how it works. I'm gonna have to see how it works. And then, so I guess it goes this way. I don't know. So this is the harness. And she got a little purse with it. So I thought that's cute. That was cute. So we're gonna have to try that on. Um, I got Gigi a toothbrush and some toothpaste. And yeah, it's an oral care puppy dental kit. <laughs> and... I got some more. Gee, I just dropped it on my bag. You okay? Sorry. Mama shot the poo poo. It's just not feeling the head a little bit. She'll be all right. I got some more um, cases to put my glasses in because I done got a bunch of more glasses and I don't have room for them. So these are already linked in my Amazon storefront. They are, what are these? Two, four, five. You can put five pairs of items in here and last but not least oops, i got a duffel bag so y'all i don't have like an overnight bag or like a little duffel bag or anything so when i went to um when i went to georgia this weekend i was telling my cousin i was like i need a, a, a overnight bag because i'm just sitting here let me see if i like these let's see if they're bigger it wasn't even that much okay this probably gonna be good it ain't even that big it's like a little purse I don't know, I'm gonna have to look at this somehow. Cause let me see what I can put in here. Cause I think it had like, yeah, it got, it had like a little compartment right here. Uh-uh, the zipper broke. Uh-uh, the zipper on this side really broke. Uh-uh, never mind, I ain't even finna show y'all. I ain't got time, so this is going back. Y'all see that? Literally just got out the bag and look at D. Y'all see that? Yeah. Never mind. Let's go um, put my uh, glasses in this, these cases. Come on. All right, y'all. So I need to change this yellow bulb in here. I don't know if y'all can tell or not, but these are... I got one more case right here that I can use. And I also have my frames in like one of these little things right here. I think I'm going to change some of these out because like these are too big. I don't know if y'all can see like those are too big for it. So I think I'm going to move those here. <sighs> but yeah, so this is what we're working with now. Hold one tight. Hold tight. All right, so I got all these done. Got all these. Bam. 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 So I got two drawers that I could put stuff in. Hey y'all, so I have not talked to y'all all day today. I don't know my tripod is, and this little thing that I'm using now. Gee, stop. No, this is not gonna work. Okay, so this little thing that I'm using now, y'all are cricket. It's just a lot going on. So me and my homegirl about to go out 
and have like a drink or two. Um, let's do some chocolate. Oh yeah, I ain't did anything today, y'all. Today is Friday. Um, it's like eight that I, I told my homegirl I was gonna come pick her up at eight. Oh, uh, let me show y'all the full fit and then I'm gonna go, I'm gonna vlog a little bit while we're out. Introduce y'all. Show y'all what I got on. I don't know if I wanna wear these heels or not. All right. So this is what I'm looking like. Ooh, I, oh, there we go, there we go. Ooh, looking a little grainy, wasn't it? So I got these little cute little heels. I think about a year ago. Love these, they are so comfortable. I got these from Fashion Nova. These frames are from Shein. I wonder why it's so dark. These earrings are from Shein. This vest is from Shein. These bracelets are from Shein. This watch is Invicta. So, y'all gotta come home and find my um, tripod. This is what I'm looking like. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, so I'm gone. I'll see y'all when we get in the car. So, we went to a place called, what we went? Oh, we went east. Marble King. We went to Marble Ring. Marble Ring. Ring. And we had a drink. Now we're headed to Adios to give me some tacos. I get each gonna get her some tacos too. <laughs> so hey y'all. Happy Sunday, y'all. It is Sunday afternoon. Wearing my real skin today again, honey. Yes, I know right my mom. So I'm headed to do a little bit of shopping, just not really shopping, just do a little bit of looking. Um, I gotta buy a cheap, one of those long dog um, leash things so I can sit her outside while I'm doing stuff. Like she can be on her little, I can hook the leash up to something and let her just play around. So I'm gonna go get one of those. I gotta get some fruit. I just gotta get a couple of things that I didn't get when I went to the grocery store yesterday. And I'm taking you to the um, to the doggy park. So we're gonna go to the park today too. It is a beautiful day outside, and I have been laying on the couch all day. So um, I didn't want to waste the rest of the day laying on the couch watching Grey's Anatomy. Y'all, why y'all ain't tell me Grey's Anatomy was so good? We got brain. Yes, I'm just now getting into Grey's Anatomy. So um, again, we're about to you know just head out and have some mommy daughter time. And I'll see y'all when we get somewhere because my phone don't want to be still on this mountain. Why is there a whole dog park and this is what G wants to do? Like you got the whole park, entire park. And here's my dog. And there's other dogs. <sighs> hey y'all, I am coming to end out this week's vlog. Um, me and my cousin are about to head, um, I think the lady's like 16 minutes away. We're about to head out. G's coming too. We're about to head, here she goes. We're about to head and go get the kitchen table. Um, and we'll be back. So, um, thank you guys for watching. I, again, I sincerely just appreciate y'all who take the time out to watch my little videos. Um, we're growing. Um, I appreciate the people who take the time to leave me a comment to like just even watching all that i really truly really and truly appreciate y'all and until next time i'll see y'all later